okay guys welcome back again to the channel so yeah as you can see brand new year we have a brand new game on this channel obviously this is not a brand new game uh, but yeah for the channel it's new so yeah as you can see even from the thumbnail we are with Everyone project cars 2 where will you begin this is where you'll need to decide whether you want to begin at the very bottom in carts and race your way up through the tiers to the very pinnacle of motorsports in tier one or simply jump straight into your favorite motorsport and begin from there mm, no let's so uh, since this is a simulation game mm, we don't need this now that you've chosen your motorsport it's time to decide which series you'll start your career in okay so this uh since this uh, simulate uh, since this is a simulation game, a racing game, uh, it's going to be very difficult for me to play with um, to play with mouse and keyboard. So I don't know how I'm going to do that. But I have played all day yesterday just to find out how the right settings. But it was very very difficult to do that. So. Uh, should we go with this one? Yep, okay. Asia Championship continued. Now that you've chosen your car, it's time to choose your livery. The livery you choose will also determine which team you'll be racing for. Okay, I don't think it matters on the performance. It's just the looks of the car. So let's go with... Uh, this one this one maybe this one okay let's choose no wait hmm okay let's take this one final step to launching your motorsport career is this your first contract if you're happy with your selections go ahead and sign once you do that your ultimate driver journey is all set to begin okay so we are now signing the contract for the career mode Confirm contract. Yes, I didn't even read the contract. So yeah, let's hope. For managing your career. Okay. The home tab is everything related to the current course series you're participating in. Here, you'll be able to head onto the track for each round, view the event calendar, check emails from your team and others, view your series standings, and read news headlines from your prior races. Okay, nice. So. Uh, home manufacturer drives invitation uh, invitational events progress and settings uh, you know what let's go straight the to the race you're about to enter. okay so practice on uh, let's do practice off let's do qualify uh, qualifying and then race five laps let's leave it like this career settings oh nice okay so as i told you since i'm playing on keyboard and mouse i have to begin lower and see where we go from there so let's do 30 30 allow restarts okay save okay our first race on the career mode okay so yeah we, uh, we have 14 minutes i think i'm gonna go for just uh, a couple of laps maybe so yeah we can call up the engineer and set it down um uh, car doesn't turn in we cannot change that suspension corners when turning in okay only that Let's see if we can change down for snow I'm spinning out, car doesn't turn into corners. Nope. We cannot change that. Okay then. Okay, we are off 
officially on the track. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. We don't have ABS on this one. <laughs> this is going to be difficult. Very difficult with the keyboard. Oh my god, we don't have even the traction control. I have to go really slow. Let's try a different camera. Oh my god, the car goes straight. Should we keep this one? No. This is the helmet view. Okay, let's go a little bit further. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. This car does not have anything. Oh. I think I need to activate ABS and traction control because since I'm a noob, yeah. Okay then, here we go. So I have done some laps and with all settings of the car to authentic, this car does not have ABS, does not have stability control and obviously does not have traction control. So I was going all over the place with the keyboard because obviously with the keyboard when you press the key you just go to the max, you don't have the luxury to input slowly the gas or brakes so it, immediate, it immediately begins to stop the front wheels if you if you brake obviously and to spin the rear wheels if you try to go, go, go if you try to accelerate so yeah, the best time I could get was 146, which is four more than four seconds from the third first place. So here is the last lap I can do, I think, with all settings, ABS, traction control, and stability control. Also, I hope I can get it, but it's really difficult with the keyboard control in these simulation cars but anyway we don't lose hope let's see now we are on the final turn can we make it can we make it 142 if we can then I guess I'm going to lower a little bit more the difficulty of the AI drivers because yeah this is going to get tough. nope we cannot okay 145 oh my god this is going to be difficult okay guys then let me finish this session and i will be right back to you with the race okay guys so i i am now on the last lap of the qualifying so I think I can pull this off if I maintain this come on break. if I maintain this rhythm come on come on come on come on so bear with me just a little bit I was a little bit slower in this one so in these simulation games if you don't break in time way ahead of the curve of the turn you won't be turning anymore so you have to keep in mind if you intend to play these kind of games with the keyboard because it's going to get pretty difficult okay two seconds I am 144 maybe I can pull it on the third place come on oh fourth place wow that was tough come on continue to racing so can i change no options i don't know if i can change the difficulty right now no i cannot oh my god 
Okay then. Oh, I don't know why I get these weird glitches from time to time. Okay, here we go. Fourth place. Second place. First place. Oh, nice. So basically, I just have to stay first now and keep the first place. Oh. Sorry guys, I have to be a little bit concentrated in here because yeah, otherwise if you crash or if you go outside the circuit one time, then that's it. Oh come on, oh. So I don't know why sometimes I get the car spinning by itself or turning by itself maybe oh my god maybe it's auto correcting itself i don't know but okay we have a little bit of lead now okay guys so basically since we are away a little bit ahead of the others and we have all that good stuff that keeps it into the road if we are careful enough obviously before we go don't forget to subscribe to the channel also turn on post notifications so you never miss one of my videos especially the videos where I will do giveaways recently one of my followers won the Metal Gear Solid 5 Phantom Pain so yeah you can have a chance to win a free pc game too so stay tuned for that definitely and yeah like and share the videos obviously because it would help my channel grow and that is the main goal of this channel obviously so you can help me about that oh my god oh my god i forgot to turn in First of all, I hope the audio and the video is good so you guys can enjoy what I am enjoying. Okay, I have to concentrate a little bit here. Okay, let's build up some a little bit of lead and I will be with you guys right back. Okay guys, last lap now. I was able to beat a little bit of lead, but not too much. So, as you can see, my fastest lap was 141, which is more than one second quicker from the qualifying time, which means I am getting used to this, to this track, obviously, but... Uh, it's uh, hmm, it's very hard with the keyboard you have to know that anyway if we do well on this last turn I think we got our first win of the career and obviously the first win for this new game project cars 2 okay then one to finish Okay, although it was a little bit on my first win. Okay, then. Okay, the results. Come on, bro. You're going to show me the results? Okay, then. First place, 31 points. Nice. Okay, then. Uh, that's, uh, let's not make this video, this first video, too long for the project cars. So yeah, all that good stuff guys, before we go away, don't forget to subscribe, like and smash the like button also. And um, also turn on post notifications so you never miss one of my videos, especially the giveaway ones. Stay tuned for that because we will do another one. I will announce that soon. And yeah, as always, catch you guys on the next ride. Bye bye.